Hey guys, it's Perry Rebecca, and I'm back here with another video. Today I'm going to teach you how to care for your lizard and how to feed it properly, give it the right food and um, stuff like that, and how to um, like understand how it's feeling. I know you're really surprised because these aren't like her other videos, but bear with her here. Yeah, bear with me here. So, I'm here with my friend, and today I got Hello. two new pet lizards. They're so awesome. They're Actually... Named and Lizzie. Lizzie and Ackerly. And so, Ackerly, um, Ackerly is my friend's lizard. Hello. Hello. I can't say. She's an acrobat. Yeah. She's an ac she's literally a natural born acrobat. She like. can walk on a, okay, so basically, we had these light cords in the tank. Yeah. Going out. And she, like, she went walking all over it, flipping under it and over it. Yeah. And so we made more vines for her, and she really enjoys playing on it. Yeah, we made, um, we had some yarn, and this is actually some stuff. So my friend, she had an old fish tank, and, um, that she used to keep her fish in. But wait, what happened to them? Did you, like, put them back in the pond? Yeah, they just kept on dying, and I just... We just want more fish. Okay, well. Yeah, fish are not a hearty pet. I mean, like, yeah. I've had 19 fish die in my house. 12 other died by my brother. Yeah. I have had, what? Zero pets? I cared, no, I've, w once I cared for two hermit crabs for about a week. Once I cared for And then for I let, I had to let them go because. For about a month. Mm, yeah. So we started a society. That's okay for what is it? Where's the poster? Okay, here's the poster. It says save the animals and our mascot birds, is a narwhal. Birds, mammals, fish and rep reptiles and amphibians. Yeah. Taking animals names off the endangered list. Founded by remember. Perry V and me. So yeah, so we so if you guys um if you guys have any animals that need caring or something like that, um, we only accept like small animals, like we no cats and dogs. No cats and no dogs, but we accept baby birds, like lizards, geckos, frogs, what else? frogs, fish, fish. Um, what else? Something that basically anything that you could keep in a tank in your room, or not a cat or a dog. Can't keep a cat in your tank, so. Besides, or a dog. You there's a, a no dog. cat policy here. And also, and we can't take those big iguanas, like those really big ones, because we don't have a tank that they're big. Because they're iguanas. We could. Yeah. I'm not sure about hamsters and mice. That'd be nice, but I'm not sure. I, yeah, I'm not sure. We have because, to check with our guardians. Yeah, we have to check. So, basically, um, we yeah, so I got two new lizards, and we actually saved them today from two eagles that were... No. Two eagles? Dude, there's... Uh, no, actually, there was 13, remember? That one that was right. behind the tree. Yeah. From 13 eagles. Yeah, from 13 eagles, and they were circling our house, and we were like, what? And so it was really weird because, like, they were just, like, circling our house. Not to mention, there has... Well, my house, but... A lot of people haven't been seeing lizards lately. I mean, like, these these yeah. kind of lizards don't hibernate. You usually see them a yeah. lot during this time. And you might be saying in the comments, like... Okay, so one thing to learn about lizards, never put two males in the same tank. Never. never. And Extra. never put a, and try not to put a male and a female in the same tank, too. Because you know what that's going to happen. You know what's going to happen. And yes, I know if you want eggs, but I know this is going to, like, break your heart. I get to say, I get to say, so we looked up on um, YouTube and on Google. Uh, Google, and we found out that, um, well, the parents they, sometimes cannibalize the hatchlings. Yes, they sometimes eat the eggs. So They'll just be like, mm, I laid an egg, but, now I want a fried omelet. Yeah, but, like, if you have a male and a female, and they mate, and so if they, like... <laughs> female and female are perfect harmony. That's female and have. female are perfect harmony. So we have, we have two females, and, um... And so Ackerley is like a natural, like I said before, a natural born acrobatist. And yeah, um, and Lizzie, yeah, she kind of, she's mellow. She hides a lot. Yeah, Lizzie is mine, and Ackerley is yours. Yeah, and so, um, 
By the way, I will Ackerley be known is jumpy. As, I will be known as the quoter. The what? The quoter. The quoter. So Ackerley is the quoters. And so um, No, no, I'm known as the quoter. No, okay. Ackerley it belongs to the quoter and um Lizzie belongs to me. So um I'm going to show you our their tank real quick. And they're both sleeping right now. Well, mine isn't because it's People nocturnal. thought it was better to look at the rainbow than to waste time digging for gold. <laughs> so here, I'm going to give you a quick peek of their tank. And you probably can't see the lizards, but, um, what? Is it Ackerley still? Yeah, Ackerley. Ackerley is up there. Um, what was Ackerley's original name? Uh, Sally. Okay. Yeah, so Ackerley's original name was Sarah. When stressed, the quarter put on loud music and made a warm casserole. I actually don't do this. I never put on um, loud music and make a warm casserole. Heck, That's I don't weird. Even know how to Are you reading a unicorn cheese. book? Okay, sorry. This is kind of weird, but it's like a I vlog. I am the quarter. Someone had told Unicorn that dark chocolate was good for his heart. They were obviously mistaken. Okay, so anyways. <laughs> okay, so anyways. um, So you have to understand. That I'm crazy. Sorry, yes. <laughs> that you're crazy. And also check out my other videos. If you're also, this is kind of in the topic, but if you're a natural born witch, then you can obviously talk to them. But, um. Okay, so more about caring for lizards, because, like, we covered, like, one. Yeah, thing. okay. Okay, so. Um, lizards love to climb yeah. and jump. We get, yeah, they love to climb and jump, so you gotta give them a big tank. We. You also need to give yeah. them a lot of things to jump on. Yeah, we got a lot of obstacles, and see that that little um rock thingy in there. That's actually a hundred million um year piece of petrified wood that I found on the beach, and um I could sell it for about fifty dollars. Well, given some but lemons, I don't want to. and that someone squirted the lemons in other people's eyes. Okay, uh, that's good with the inspirational quotes. So, <laughs> so as I was saying, you've got to give them a lot of catwalks to do, and you've got to know the personality, what they like, and stuff. Um, so, anyway, back to feeding them. Also, you don't need a lot of water for them. I only put one shell of water in there for them. Um, but then there's also this container. Um, I kept the big one. I kept... I kept, um, what, 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 I kept, sh no, not Shelly, what is her name? Oh, she's still in there. Um, Lizzie, I kept Lizzie in here for about 30 minutes because we just caught her. And so, these are actually endangered, so we're trying to keep these. Um, well, they're endangered in our neighborhood. But, anyway, you probably want to hear me stop talking because I'm so boring. Anyway. <laughs> Unicorn hoped you could never have too much love. Then he realized if you get hugged for too long, it hurts. And then, I don't know if you can see, but Lizzie is in there. She's in the tank, everyone. Back out. We have a radioactive lizard and a radioactive tank. <laughs> so, also, I just wanted to say something. Um, just have this up real quick. Um, if you... Okay, if you watch... Oh, my friend. Well, yeah. I mean, sorry, stop. What? What? What did you just call me? What? What did you just call me? Dude, this is my name, dude. What did you just call me? Oh my gosh, I mistaked you for another one of my friends. Oh my god. I'm Dude, sorry. you can't remember this beautiful face. Wow. <sighs> you make a me crazy. <laughs> you just read that off my wall. Yes. You just read that off my wall. What is wrong with you? Yes, I did. 
Okay, so anyway, if you watch my other video, um, also if you're a natural born witch, you could probably talk, or wizard, you could probably talk to them, um, see how they feel, see what they like, you know, you can put what they need in there. And also, we're going to go to PetSmart tomorrow to buy crickets. Unicorn found that whenever one door shut, another one opened. <laughs> so anyway, that's going to cap it off for today. So thank you guys um, for watching.